The United States Navy has officially announced the construction of 19 new warships as part of its fleet modernization program. This multi-billion dollar project is promoted as a major leap toward the next generation of stealth surface vessels. Yet behind these ambitious claims lies a crucial question. Can stealth technology truly deliver a meaningful advantage on the battlefield? Or will it risk becoming an investment that fails to match its cost? The decision to expand the fleet marks a new chapter in U.S. maritime strategy. As global competition intensifies, the new ships are expected to become the backbone of future operations. Their central focus, stealth capabilities that are said to redefine the nature of naval warfare. This video examines those claims, exploring whether the promise of invisibility can withstand the realities of modern detection technologies. The Stealth Promise, Emerging Technologies and Doctrine. Each vessel in this new program is equipped with innovations designed to drastically reduce radar signatures. These include low-profile hull designs, radar-absorbent materials, and structural arrangements that minimize visual and acoustic detection. In theory, these features offer a strategic edge surprise, the ability to approach undetected, and opportunities for preemptive strikes. The U.S. Navy views stealth technology as a direct response to increasingly complex maritime threats, including the rise of other major powers that continue to enhance their naval forces. Reality Check – Modern Detection Challenges Stealth Dominance However, the journey toward truly invisible warships is far from straightforward. Rapid advancements in sensor technology, ranging from AI-enhanced radar systems and high-resolution satellite networks to next-generation acoustic sensors, are gradually eroding the advantages of traditional stealth. Additionally, the intense focus on stealth comes with trade-offs, escalating construction and maintenance costs, greater technical complexity, and reduced internal space for certain weapon systems. Recent multinational exercises have also raised questions about how effective stealth ships really are when confronted with state-of-the-art detection systems. Strategic Impact – Shifting the Global Naval Balance Regardless of the debate over stealth effectiveness, the arrival of 19 new U.S. warships is seen as a significant strategic adjustment. The expanded fleet is expected to influence power dynamics across key maritime regions, from the Western Pacific to the Arctic. This move is also triggering chain reactions among rival nations. Many are accelerating investments in anti-stealth technologies or expanding their own fleets, signaling the potential start of a new naval arms race. The Future Fleet – Rising Costs and Strategic Direction The massive investment has sparked widespread debate at home. Concerns over budget overruns, defense spending priorities, and long-term effectiveness are now central topics among analysts and the public. Ultimately, the primary question remains unchanged. Is the heavy emphasis on stealth truly the best path forward for the U.S. Navy? Or do global technological shifts demand a different strategic approach? These 19 new warships will serve as a critical test, whether they spark a revolution in naval warfare or become a reminder of how costly the pursuit of outdated advantages can be in 21st century conflict. Industrial Pressure and Production Challenges 
The program also places U.S. shipbuilding industries under intense scrutiny. Major defense contractors must significantly increase production capacity while maintaining the highest quality standards. Under tight construction schedules, shipyards must confront familiar challenges, component delays, shortages of skilled labor, and the adoption of new manufacturing technologies required for stealth designs. Industry analysts warn that the timeline for this fleet is highly ambitious, given the increased technical complexity compared to previous ship classes. Even minor construction errors, such as imperfect hull angles or misalignment of radar absorbent materials, could severely degrade the ship's stealth performance. Evolving stealth technology, effective but not invincible. While stealth remains a key focus, experts emphasize that it is not a flawless shield. Stealth reduces detection risk. It does not eliminate it. Minor changes in weather conditions, sea surface quality, or enemy scanning methods can affect how visible a vessel is to radar or optical sensors. Experts also highlight that modern detection systems no longer rely on a single type of radar. Multi-sensor integration, combining optical, infrared, low-frequency radar, and acoustic systems, forces stealth concepts to evolve continuously. In other words, achieving invisibility is no longer just about ship design. It requires a fully integrated system that suppresses signatures across multiple detection spectrums. A new approach to surface warfare. Beyond stealth, the new ships are designed to support evolving U.S. Navy operational concepts. With long-range missiles and precision drones becoming more dangerous, surface combatants must now be more agile, faster in decision-making, and fully integrated into layered defense networks. Defense officials highlight the need to combine stealth with cyber and electronic warfare capabilities. A ship that is difficult to detect offers only limited advantages if it lacks secure communications, AI-driven data processing, and robust defenses against electronic attacks. Conclusion, a high-stakes gamble in an uncertain maritime era. The 19-ship program places the United States at a crossroads between innovation and risk. These vessels could symbolize a new era of modern sea power or expose the limits of how far stealth technology can go against next-generation detection with global geopolitics in constant motion and adversaries strengthening their capabilities. The future performance of this fleet will play a decisive role in shaping U.S. maritime strategy. The final question remains, will these stealth warships become decisive assets in 21st century conflict? Or will they ignite new debates over the relevance and cost-effectiveness of stealth in modern naval warfare? <laughs>